Hello, in this video I'll be sorting a deck of cards using five different algorithms. Merge sort, quick sort, binary insertion sort, bucket sort, and a mystery sort. Make sure to stick around to the end to find out what it is. First up is merge sort. This is a pretty common sorting algorithm for computers. If you're familiar with time complexity, it's O n log n. This algorithm is a recursive algorithm. Basically how it works is, to sort a deck, you split it into two decks, sort one half using merge sort, then sort the other half, and then merge them together. Merging works by comparing the top two cards of both halves and placing the higher card down. Then compare the top two cards again, rinse and repeat, and then they've been merged. Since this is a recursive algorithm, we must have a base case. In this algorithm, it's pretty simple. If there's just one card to sort, just return it. Now here's the full footage. Second is quicksort. This is also a pretty common algorithm, and as the name suggests, its time complexity is the same as merge sort at O n log n. This algorithm is also recursive. Basically, you select a pivot card and then divide the rest of the cards into cards that are lower and cards that are higher. Then you sort those and put it all together. The base case for this particular algorithm is the same as merge sort. If there's one card, then it's already sorted. Here's the full footage. Third up is binary insertion sort. This is a far more intuitive algorithm for humans. Basically, you go through all the cards in the deck, and then put them into a second deck, which is always sorted. Since it's always sorted, we can find where a new card should go pretty efficiently, in O log n time. I think you get the idea. Now we have bucket sort. This is probably the way most people would sort a deck of cards. The idea is to sort the cards into buckets and then sort each bucket individually. There are actually two ways I can think of to do this for a deck of cards. You could either make the buckets the suits and then sort each suit using binary insertion sort or something, or you could just make 52 buckets, which is what I did here. This algorithm is linear, but it requires you to have a reasonable input and know something about the input. On average, it runs in ON time, but it isn't always appropriate, so it's not often used in general implementations of sorting. Finally, we have the mystery sort. Take a guess, what do you think it's gonna be? Well, it's solitaire sort. Basically, uh, when you play solitaire, or at least the version I know, you end up with a sorted deck. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. 
I know I didn't include a lot of algorithms in here, like heap sort or bubble sort or bogo slash shuffle sort, mostly because they would have been inconvenient. So please leave any feedback in the comments, and I'll see you next time.